hello guys this is Angar Rizky and welcome back to my video so today uh, this, is, this is my first time to getting started with uh, sketch app and Android studio so uh, we will be able to learn about sketch app and then we will implement it into Android studio so we gonna to design the uh, splash screen that we will implement in Android studio we need to create new document in sketch app and i will create new artboard here with a insert and then select the artboard uh, maybe i will choose the mobile mobile portrait okay okay so this is the mobile portrait and i will change the name to artboard sorry <laughs> uh, i will change the name to splash screen plus screen all right and then i will to create a background with the red rectangle for the background and of course i will remove the border and change the field color to the blue okay we have the background here okay the next one i will create another shape so we i'm gonna to insert shape uh, sorry uh, vector okay and create here and create here create here and create here and then we go to edit like this okay and we're gonna to get the fill color here and I will change the color with the blue another blue like this and remove the border color and then we need to skip and get the shadow and the blur is uh, 20 and of course I will decrease the opacity to 30 pixel okay like this and the y is zero okay we can copy style copy okay and i want to create another shape again with the vector here so i will create here create here and click here here and we're gonna to edit the border and the fill color and go to blue like this okay and i will pass the style and change the color to the another blue like this all right so next i will create another shape again so i'm going to insert vector and create here and here and here it's only random and get the fill color to the blue like this and remove the border and go to edit to make sure that the corner is good and then we can pass style and need to edit again uh, I will another blue Okay, it's cool, right? Uh, and then I will change this like this. Pretty cool, okay? <laughs> okay, so the next one, select the BG and click right and go to mesh. And then select all of them and group selection and give the name is BG because the main is background so it shall be like this okay the next thing we need to create the background sorry we need to create the button so we're gonna to go to insert shape and rounded and then i will draw the button here and make sure the button to the center with the ALT on your keyboard 
the margin is 60 from the button 60 and I will use the yellow color mm, I will another color use another color maybe white okay it's cool white and get the shadow here and setting the blur to 15 and setting the white to 5 and setting the opacity to 30 pixel sorry 30 percent okay and then change the name to the BG and uh, put something text here so we're gonna to insert and text and click here and get started and then I will change the font size to the 20 no 24 uh, maybe I prefer like to 20 22 okay it's cool and make sure to the center oh sorry select all of them and make sure to the center and then I will change the color to the blue like this okay and select all of them and make two group to button like this the next one I will create some paragraph here so we're gonna to insert and text and click here to hello world they usually we text it hello world and I will change the font to regular and the font size to uh, maybe 55 now it's too big so I'm gonna do 48 okay I think it's enough and then change to the light like this and I will duplicate this layer to create a paragraph and I need the lorem ipsum here so I will copy the text for dummy text and go back to your sketch and change the font size to the yes 18 and just make sure the element is left and then I will copy like this and enter and enter and enter again and make to center like this it's pretty cool okay make to center okay like this so this is our design that we will implement in android studio Before we go to Android, we need to slice by layer, so click splash screen and then make export able and export splash screen and then go to desktop and you create new folder for the assets assets, okay, we create and this is the splash screen and go to BG and make export able export BG in the asset folder and the button make exportable export button and save so we're gonna to check the preview first so we have the BG and the button and the preview for uh, for the cheat okay so we're gonna to Android studio and start a new Android studio project and I will give the name is my application so next so next and we gonna to empty FVTV so next and finish and then we waiting for Gradle build in Android Studio just take a several time it's okay okay now we are ready for create the XML here and we go to XML so this is uh, initializing for rendering the library because we get the pawn here like uh, emulator 
so just waiting for it okay this is our application you can see that this uh, hello world okay we go to text and then I will change the font size Android uh, sorry text size and then we go back to sketch to see uh, 40x okay 40x 48 pixel and the alignment is left uh, sorry it's uh, center text alignment text alignment to the center okay and then we're gonna to save and go back to the design and like this it's all be to center but it doesn't working properly oh sorry sorry maybe i will remove this first okay we focus on the background first so i will create the background here android background draw uh, oh man i'm forgot something so we go to our desktop and copy all of them without splash screen copy copy the bg and the button copy and then we create the my application here and go to app and then go to source and mine and rest and drawable and you pass all of them bg and the button and we can access it from the rest drawable we have the bg we have the bg and then we have the uh, button here so we just need to draw able and go to bg and go, to go back to design and boom we got it <laughs> okay so i want to remove the header like uh, my application so i'm going to manifest and double click and you can see here the label you just need to remove it like this and you can see back again oh yes you need to save the file first and then i want to remove the header so we go to value and style here and dark action bar we're gonna to change the no action bar and save and you can see there's no header again it's good right okay so what's next we go back we go back to the text and create here to the button like this and then i will wrap the content and match pattern sorry no 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 the hex it shall be let me check first the hex is 60 you can see 60 so we need to 60 pixel and then get the background here drawable and button and we're gonna to save and boom we got it but <laughs> yeah it's worth i think maybe like this 60 to 60 it's okay no uh, 60 60 and yeah I think it's enough and then I will make to center and it uh, to the center so make to button first is no two uh, we're gonna to change the aliens Sorry, it's Android and parent bottom it's true we check oh okay we got it and then I want to make sure the left margin left it's uh, 30 pixel no it's not enough so we're gonna to change to 60 pixel now maybe 
90 no it's too much maybe uh, 70 yeah okay 75 75 okay okay I think it's enough okay <laughs> so the last one we need to create the text here so we're gonna to check the label we got this one let's text we just need to drag here drag boom and go back to the text and change the name to hello world and change the color text color to the white and the text uh, sorry android text size to so oh it's too big the white change to uh, hex code no maybe 90 okay it's enough and we copy again the lorem ipsum and then i will create a small text sorry medium text here and we need to edit the medium text this boom and we got the android text color to the f f f f f f and just make sure the text is to the center center oops okay and text sorry android text aliens uh land height land spacing extra and we need to 18 sorry <laughs> we need to 18 pixel no it's 16 no 12 okay it's enough and you can run in your computer or you can run in your android but the preview it shall be like this okay so thank you very much for watching this video tutorial and i hope i can show you another video with uh, sketchup and android or photoshop and android because this is my first time with the sketchup and android <laughs> okay so don't forget to subscribe my channel in youtube and see you the next video tutorial goodbye